Hey guys, welcome in. I am Zordon of Doom. I'm a singer, songwriter, and I make content here on YouTube. I also stream on Twitch. And if you've stumbled into this random Wednesday video that's dropping Pacific Standard Time, because it might not be Wednesday for you, question mark, depending on your time zone. This is where I react to random things that tickle my fancy, and I have dubbed it Whimsy Wednesday. Today, I will be reacting to something completely new, something completely random that I have not touched before, but it was requested by a friendo. So this request is made by Jesse of Jesse's Auditorium here on YouTube, also a wonderful React channel to music from various video games. Yeah, if you don't know who Jesse is, go fix that and go subscribe to his channel. Thank you so much for the request. I did not hear about this game. I've seen it before, but I thought it was, I don't know, I know nothing about the game. I thought this, is this an offshoot of Donkey Kong? All I know about this is the picture of a character with red hair. Just looking at this cover. And it's saying, Ape Escape Originate Soundtracks. Manufactured and distributed by Far East Recording Inc. Japan. 2011. So this, is this a, like a remaster of the old tracks or is this just a compilation CD of all of the old tracks? from Ape Escape. Kachinkoru Sea? Or the Sea of Kachinkoru? Snowy Mammoth. I'm assuming the song is called Snowy Mammoth. Let's get into the reaction. What do I expect from this before I actually hear it? No expectations. I'm, ex I'm assuming based on the ape that it's going to be a wacky jungle theme of some sort, I, but it's a snowy mammoth. So it's gonna be a snow theme. It has to be like some type of like bells that you usually hear in like a snow landscape, like a snowy landscape, but a, an ape in the snow? Oh, but it's a snowy mammoth. So it's a mammoth that's usually in snow. Is this the name of a character the ape knows? Or is the ape trying to escape the snowy mammoth? <laughs> my, my imagination is going wild. Jesse said it would be fun to to see me figure out what could possibly be happening based on what I hear. But just just the name alone, we got Snowy Mammoth, we got Kachinkoru, or the Sea of Kachinkoru, and an ape, and I don't know, is this kid holding a sword or wearing a mask? I'm very confused. We got sea, we got snow, we got ape. So ape makes me think jungle. Here we go. In three, Two and one. Okay. This feels urgent. Bad things happening. This does feel like stealth. Try to escape. Having no context is hard. Okay. Ooh. think that there's like technology this feels like inside of a submarine inside of a at the bottom of the sea It's called Snowy Mammoth. Wait, huh? So the sea, the, the sea is throwing me off. I have to admit, 
admit, it does have like a dongle feel to it. I could definitely see an ape trying to escape. I'm so curious about this game. like underwater or even like tech like you're in a submarine or in a small enclosed space that has water around it I don't know I don't know what I'm talking about but then you got the bells that could be snow that's this is a really cool facto just based on how this sounds, this sounds like a compilation. This doesn't sound like a remaster or a remix. Because it this I could definitely hear with those graphics. <laughs> it's interesting because even the album cover gives you nothing because the background is just white. The melody that you could place this in the mountains. You could place this at the bottom of the sea. For some reason, my brain is thinking like submerging because you also had that the sound. Where is it? Ding. I don't know what you call that. What do you even call that? Usually you would hear that when someone is holding a shield or something and like the light hits it. And so that's why it makes me think of metal. So when the light hits it, it's the weird sound effect that you make when you when something creaks and then light bounces off and then it hits something else. I don't know how else to describe it. According to Jesse, this is one of the most influential OSTs for him. Anything related to Originate, Ape Escape, this is the first track that I've listened to. I'd be very interested in hearing the other songs from Ape Escape. I'm very intrigued. I feel like this is very original. I cannot place this sound in another video game of this time. I'm trying to think of the closest, uh, like that melody, maybe I could hear it in, I'm trying to imagine myself playing the game. <laughs> I could see this being a platformer or a puzzle game, but I honestly, just from the song alone, I could see you moving around the map. I don't know anything about the gameplay, so I'm just guessing. Please correct me. If you have played this in the comments, tell me how much I'm wrong. <laughs> Educate me just based on this first track. Oh, I know what it is. It kind of reminds me of Live Alive a little bit, the soundtrack in a way which was done, I think, by Yoko Shimomura. I don't know if anyone else worked on that as well. I could hear possibly the wind blowing, like they could add that sound effect as you're exploring the map. Live Alive was definitely an experience that if you haven't played it, I highly recommend. It's very fun and different. I kind of wish there were more games like it. But yeah, I think that's it for my theorizing. I feel like I just kept rambling because I was trying to grip at straws and you know latch onto something everything that i have is pretty much just guesswork i haven't done any prior research i do like theorizing and guessing but anyways guys i think that is it for this reaction if you've made it all the way to the end i appreciate you you are epic and fantastic let me know if you want me to react to more ape escape songs or anything on the originate soundtrack if that's something you want to hear would love to hear from you leave it down in the comments don't forget to like the video subscribe to the channel and check out jesse's auditorium and his twitch as well hey i'm uncle jesse i will leave his socials down in the description or to the side in the description wherever the description is and don't forget that no matter how it is you are feeling 
U R A W E S O M E U R A W E S O M E. All right, guys, I will see you all in the next video, whether it be Fandom Friday, Sonic Saturday, or whenever I see you. All right, guys, bye bye.